Hello, hello. It is 9.15 and we are on our way to work out this morning and it is disgusting out. But first we have to stop at Starbucks to get drinks, obviously, to get energy to go work out. But Mar Mariah is coming inside with me today and I wish she was as excited as I am. I'm excited. She is excited. I'm so excited. So I'm going to video the workout and you guys see <gasps> Michaela work out. Yes. Yeah. Hopefully I'm do good. Oh, you will. No pressure. You will. I'm at ATF now. The building's right behind you. I'll show you in a second. Mariah's getting my wheelchair out and hopefully the camera doesn't fall. But we made it to ATF and so the class doesn't start for another 30 minutes but everybody comes in and hangs out. Kind of stretches, warms up, does all the fun things so that when the class actually starts we can like go full throttle and not have to warm up then. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited. My class is like a wide range of injuries and things and ages as well. I'm the youngest in my class, but only by two years. There's a 19 year old boy, 20 year old, 20 year old boy, I think, 22 year old girl, and then ages go up from there. And I think the oldest is 62, which is pretty cool. There's only 11 of us in the class and it's really cool. And there's service dogs too, which is, I love them. I love them. They're so cute. Um, I'm about to get in my chair and go inside. Last sip. And we're gonna go kill it. I'm gonna explain what I'm doing. I'm starting to shift my weight more into my feet and my legs. And as I do that, it's making it harder to get my feet out. But what I'm trying to do is get out of my chair from the front, which you will see me do in a few seconds. But as you see, it's kind of trial and error. Where's Fitz? Where's Fitz? Tab! Where's Fitz? After all of that, I'm so happy that I got out successfully. So now I'm doing a thing called a quadruped where I have my weight in my hands and my knees and I'm working on balance in my core. Now you see me um, bridging up, working on my core strength and kind of Trying to put the weight in my heels, it's, it doesn't look like I'm doing much, but it is a lot of work and definitely still a work in progress. But I do all these things before the class has even started, which is pretty crazy. I'm already sweating before it even starts. As you can see here, I'm rowing um, and it looks a little different than a normal row machine. Obviously, my legs don't pull when I'm rowing. So they're able to pull that little thing out and I'm able to strap in my feet just like you would. And for core stability, I have a band behind me so I can focus on the actual rowing part of it. Now you see me practicing core stability with this bar and a bungee cord. So my trainer's behind me pushing or I guess pulling different ways and I'm having to kind of equal out what he's doing um, and it's difficult because I can't see which way he's about to go. So I'm practicing lower, middle, and then upper, which works different parts of my core. Here I am doing a different type of stability. This one is for my core, my shoulders, my arms, triceps, biceps, all the fun stuff. Um, so I'm pushing out and then slowly going in while they're resisting me. Um, and I really like this one. This one's pretty fun. You need to ring the bell because this is a this is a goal you set for yourself to get out the front of your chair, and um, and you're already half it. So. I'm gonna be honest for this next clip I don't know exactly how to explain it but I know that it was very difficult to do and it took a lot of concentration and practice but I'm working on sitting up with the weighted plate working on strengthening my arms and my grip as well um, and I just know I did it a bunch and you can kind of see for yourself what I'm working on
Next up, this one's so fun to do. I just get to pass the ball. Um, and it, once again, for a bull body, this would be super easy. But um, this is really working on my core. I'm having to um, move my arms together at the same time, which is difficult for me to do and kind of squeeze my core so I can really press up and throw the ball with force. Um, I kind of got it down, him and I got a pattern down and we we're getting pretty good. Here you get to see the struggle that all these clips are amazing, but there's struggle behind all of it. You see here, it looks like I'm failing, but I'm actually not. I'm trying to kind of shift my weight um, between arms and push my body forward over this thing here, this black mat. Um, to get in a plank position, but just to get in positions to start the workout, it takes a lot of energy, as you can tell, but it's, um, it's interesting to see, you know, you don't realize until you kind of see all the behind the scene clips, but we're about to get there. We're almost there. Look at that. Gotta show that, gotta show that distance right there. Gotta show the hard work, that good form, that good technique. Nice. Yeah, nice. Heck yeah, man, let's go. 20 seconds. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13. We burning yet? 12, 11, stay tall. Up, 10, 9, up, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, keep holding. 2, 1, 10 more seconds. 9, 8, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, time. We're gonna have a heart. finished my workout and it was a good one. I got to ring the bell for the first time, which is so exciting. Um, and so ringing the bell is like, you basically accomplished and achieved one of your goals, which is so exciting because it's only week two and I achieved one of my goals, which was getting out of my chair forward, like being able to control it. Um, I've tried a few times, but they've been, I've been all over the place and then I fall and flop down and I was finally able to control it. I think I got it on video, if not, um, did. I'll be able to do it again. But uh, we were just so proud because again, that's something that they're like, oh, you'll never be able to do. Like you'll need help getting in and out of your chair and everything. And just to be able to like get on the ground by myself and not like fall is so cool. Um, so I'm so proud of that. And then after every um, workout, they give us meals because obviously nutrition is like, I don't know what percent, but it's a big percent of your recovery and your fuel, you know, food is fuel. So they give us food and I got, you know, chef? I got steak, asparagus and sweet potatoes. I don't like sweet potatoes, but Mariah's eating them. And then they made us protein shakes too as well. So it's really good. Um, and then obviously drinking a bunch of water, smoothies, all that fun stuff. And then I'm gonna be honest, I'm a fast food gal. I love fast food <laughs> and my family eats it more than we'd like to admit. Um, but it's important to have a healthy balance. Like they said, they're like, you can still eat it. Just don't eat it every meal. So that's what we're doing. Anyway, so it's a great workout. I love working out there. It's just, it makes you so motivated. Anyways, that's it for, oh, right now.